back to my YouTube channel. So today we are going to be making Cajun chicken pasta. So if you haven't noticed, I really love onions. Um, I like to cook with onions a lot in my food. So we are going to get started with that. So I already have a pan here with olive oil. It's checking to see that it was hot. So we're going to get started with that. So I already diced the, ice, the onions up. So now we're going to just add the onions to the pot. Okay, so you're going to need chicken breast for this, of course, for this chicken pasta. Um, I usually just use chicken breast and then I just cut them up into strips. I've already seasoned them up. I'll show you what I use um, as far as my seasonings for this chicken. So we're just going to let the chicken cook. So this is what I use. Now that Tony's, y'all better watch out because that thing will have you sneezing. But the seasoning is really, really good. So now we're gonna start with the sauce, the Alfredo sauce from scratch. So you're gonna get you some butter. Move it around. Now, I usually use garlic butter when I'm making the Alfredo sauce, but I forgot to grab it from the store. So I'm just gonna add some minced garlic to the butter. So now you're gonna add your heavy whipping cream. I usually get a pint from wherever I get it from. I'll just get a pint and now I'm just gonna add some Parmesan cheese. Now remember, this is cheese and milk and butter. So you wanna cook this on a low heat. If you cook it too high, your cheese will burn and you don't want that. Okay, now you see it's starting to boil a bit. So now you know to turn your heat off. The sauce has gotten thick, so now it's ready to go. And you see how cheesy and creamy and thick it is. So now we're gonna just turn that heat off. So the chicken is done now. I'm just gonna give it one last little stir. Then you're gonna take your noodles that are drained and add them to the pan. And now you're gonna add your Alfredo sauce. Now I don't like to um, pour all of it at once, so I'm just gonna leave a little bit out. So you're just gonna stir, 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 mix it all up, get it all in there. Okay, so now that you've done all the mixing, you're gonna take your Cajun pasta. I meant Cajun season, and you're gonna season it all up with the Cajun. Give it that little spice. Now 
I'm gonna add some more cheese. You can also add um, cayenne pepper to it to make it more spicy if you want. It's up to your spice level. But that Cajun seasoning that I'm using, um, it usually gets the job done. I added more cheese again. <laughs> Stir it up. Y'all, it looks so creamy. It was so good, too. Now, if you do want to make um, jerk chicken pasta, instead of adding the Cajun, like I did just now, you can just add jerk seasoning. I like to use Walker's Wood or Grace jerk seasoning, the mild, because um, that can get really spicy too. So, um, I usually just add like two scoops of, of the jerk seasoning, and that's how you'll make the jerk um, chicken pasta. It's all the same concept. Once you get the chicken and then you add your sauce and your noodles, you can pretty much make any type of pasta you want. Now, see, that was quick and painless. So easy. Um, this is the finishing touches of the Cajun chicken pasta. I want to thank you so, so much for watching this video. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Please comment down below on any videos you would like to see me record. It could be cooking. It could be everyday life things. I'm open to whatever. Just let me know. Please comment down below. And please follow me on Instagram at Fairly Bazaar. Um, and you know, you can drop ideas for me on there too. And thank you so, so much for watching this video again. And until next time, bye.